Hey guys, so excuse my slob kebab appearance. Of course I just got off work and I was expecting a package today. This is my Christmas present from my husband slash to myself. Because we don't really buy each other stuff, we just buy stuff that we've been wanting. So I bought um, kind of a lot of stuff from Makeup Geek because I haven't bought anything from there in a long time. So funny story, I was checking out and I finished and I didn't notice until after I got my confirmation email. Like a couple months ago I had added stuff to my basket and um, I never checked out and so apparently it was still in the basket when I paid for this stuff. So I got three extra eyeshadows that I wasn't even expecting to get. So I'll start with those. I'll start with the their regular eyeshadows. And those come in these little packages like this. The first one is Latte. Oh wow, these are going to take me a second to open. That's Latte. And I'm just sticking them in my little MAC palettes that I already have. <clears throat> Hopefully these are magnetic because if not I'm in trouble. But it's, I don't know, 12.30 at night and I just got home. This is Frappe. Like from McDonald's. <laughs> and this one is Chickadee. So these are all my regular eyeshadows that I have for Makeup Geek and this one won't go in correctly. See how it's sticking up? But I don't want to mess with it because I'm afraid I'm going to break it so I'm just going to close that up. And it won't close all the way. Oh well. I'll fix it later. So I got one loose pigment and this is Utopia. I haven't picked up any of their loose pigments since they changed the packaging. It's cute. And you're not going to be able to really see the color. But I think this is like one of those duochrome ones. It looks really pretty online. I think it's like black and like a greenish gold or something like that. I'll definitely be doing a tutorial with that probably. So they were still having, on the website it still said Black Friday special or whatever. So I got all 20 of the foiled eyeshadows. Because it was 30% off if you bought all 20 of them. So the first one is Untamed. Oh my gosh. And I don't it's that. So I'm just sticking them in my little Mac palette like this. Because I don't have the little inserts things to hold them right now. Pegasus. Masquerade. Ooh. That's awesome. Magic Act. I've been wanting these since they came out, but I never bought them. It's funny, like, I always forget about Makeup Geek Jester. And I really do enjoy their products. Next thing I want is all those dual chrome shadows and pigments that they have. Um, but the bundle that they had online was out of stock. This is whimsical. In the spotlight. High wire. Ooh. Houdini. That one's awesome. 
I can't wait to use these. I'm so excited. Fortune teller. Holy crap. That looks like that liquid gold or whatever it's called. Is that a pigment or something like that? But that's really intense. Well, all of these are intense. Oh, I know I love this one. I've seen flamethrower. Very nice. Fantasy. Daydreamer. It's really pretty. Charmed. Center stage. It's like a purpley blue. It almost, well, indigo? Is that what that is? But it looks more blue on camera. But when you actually look at it, it looks a lot purplier. Caitlin Rose. Showtime. I think I got three more. Oh, this one's like my favorite, I think. Grandstand. Just by looking at it, it reminds me of Max Tan Pigment. I guess we'll see once I actually wear it. Starry-eyed. That reminds me a little bit of Stila's kitten, but more pink. But it's got that intense look to it. I think this is the last one. Mesmerized. Ooh, so pretty. Let me just count real quick. Yep, 20. That's all 20. Okay, so I don't think these are really as magnetic as I thought, because look, they're moving around. So I'm probably going to have to buy some magnets for that, or you know what, I need to just get the little insert because these will fit in there. But I had, I have an empty, this was like the blush palette, I have the insert for the blush, but I popped it out because it's four blushes I haven't depotted yet, that way these are safe somewhere. I just got to make sure that... I have it laying down at all times. Um, the only other thing that I got recently too um, was this YSL Fusion Ink Foundation. And I've tried it once so far and unfortunately it has it sticks to like my forehead really bad like my dry skin. Um, so I'm gonna try it probably one more time and if it does the same thing, I might have to return this. Because even with the Beauty Blender, it's, it was just clinging to those dry patches. Um, I don't know. I don't... I want to love it, and I hope I can get it to work for me, because this is amazing. And I really like the... Whatever this one's called. Touche Cla. It's almost gone. That's why I bought this one, because I wanted to try it. So, if... That one fails me, I'll just get a new one of this because, as you can see, it's been well loved. So if you wanted to check out those Makeup Geek eyeshadows, make sure you do it while they still have that Black Friday sale going, even though today's December 15th and they're, sh they're still showing those prices. So thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you next time. Yay!